Uh, let me welcome uh, members to the sixth meeting in 2016 of the Standards, Procedures and Public Appointments Committee and remind everybody as usual, switch off their mobile phones. Um, our first uh, agenda item today is to consider our annual report. Uh, we have uh, a, a report in front of us and I invite comments from members. Is anyone, anyone, anything they wish to say? On the... Um, annual report. Yes, please. I just wondered whether under cross-party groups, given that we mention a complaint against a member, whether we shouldn't also mention that we did look at complaints against cross-party groups? I think that's probably a fair comment. Mm -hmm. Yeah, 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 mm -hmm. yeah, yeah, that would be a fair comment. Uh, we had two of them, if I recall correctly. Mm, yeah. I think we can probably rely on the clerks to <laughs> draft Absolutely. something that we, we, yeah. we would be happy with and let convener and deputy convener sign that off. Mm -hmm. Yeah, no, that would be fine. If we're okay with yeah. that. Anything else anybody wants to say about the annual report? Keep going, Patricia, if you wish. <laughs> I, I'm being pedantic here. Oh, please um, do. Slightly. Surprise, surprise. Under bills and the Lobbying Scotland bill, uh, paragraph 10, a number of amendments were agreed to. Um, I can't remember the number. It didn't feel like that many to me on the day. And I would quite like it to say a number of government amendments were agreed to, because I think it only was government ag amendments that were agreed to. I, I'm perfectly content. Mm. It's a factual statement of what okay. happened. Cameron, Cameron oh, beg your pardon. We are being reminded Cameron actually had one accepted. Yeah, I did. Did he? No. No. One, I think, wasn't it? No. No, it wasn't um, accepted. Unfortunately, I've not brought my lobbying folder. I can, I can check that. You wouldn't mind checking. Yeah. We'll, yeah. we'll check the veracity of that yeah. and right, make what, 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 yeah, what, what, what the report Thank says. It, let's put it this way. If we find Cameron did indeed succeed in an amendment, and I've no recollection, then we'll leave it as is. Mm -hmm. But if we find it was only government, and I'm perfectly content yeah. that it says government, Patricia. Okay. Uh, so we'll leave again that's a matter of yeah. uh, fact to be to be adjusted. Anything and I, else? I had a question to be honest. Under engagement and innovation, we talk about a leaflet being produced which summarised um, the bill on lobbying. <coughs> that this was distributed to members who visited uh, pub, the pub, members of the public rather who visited the Parliament, and that there was an electronic version too. I just wondered whether that had had any noticeable effect because it's all very well doing something like that. But if it had a noticeable effect, then it's worth saying that and encouraging others to perhaps do likewise. But if it had no noticeable effect, then maybe we have to own up to that. The problem is we don't have it. That's do you want to come to the table? Yeah, just so, so that... To it with because the official it. report and needs to Sorry. pick you up. Okay. So, so um, it's... I've Can you turn your microphone? Right? Something that I have um, thought about myself and um, the difficulty is that we, we haven't really done... Um, a similar piece of work without a leaflet. So it's very hard to work out which um, contributors to the inquiry were as a result of the leaflet. So I didn't feel that it was possible to do any um, evaluation, unfortunately. Okay, fair enough. So we'll leave it as is. Yeah, absolutely. Right. Okay, if there's nothing else, uh, colleagues, um, uh, I invite uh, subject to the discussions we've had, members to agree, uh, that we're content with the report and we delegate to the convener and deputy convener uh, the amendments that we've discussed. Right, we're content. That ends the public part of the meeting.